Okay, a lot of people have asked me about my opinion about hyperinflation. And we have here this graph, which is on Google Images, and it shows the um, it shows how much currency is in circulation. You have the bottom one is the green is the U.S. dollars. Then you have the Japanese yen. Then you have the euro. Then you have the can the Chinese yuan, and then you have the uh, then you have all other currencies. And so, most countries around the world are printing money at about the same rate. So it all balances out. So. Um, America is not going to experience any hyperinflation. And then when we look at Zimbabwe, a lot of people, they quote Zimbabwe, and we see that in uh, 98 through 99, real estate doubled in price in Zimbabwe. That's tremendous inflation. We haven't had that in America um, ever, as far as I know. 2000 through 2001, real estate tripled. We've never had that in America. And the, the 10 years prior to that, it was, it was not as much, but it was similar inflation. 2002, real estate tripled. In just one year, real estate tripled. In 2004, real estate doubled. Uh, real estate, 2003, real estate went up six times in price. It's never happened in America. 2004, real estate doubled in price. 2005, real estate went up six times. Okay, none of these have ever happened in America. So what I say is that real estate in the, in the decade prior to the Zimbabwe collapse, real estate went up 1,648 times. In 2006, the year prior to the collapse, it went up 13 times in price. And the decade prior to that, it went up not as much, but it was very high inflation. And so Zimbabwe had two decades of very high inflation before their, their dollar collapsed. And so they were by far um, printing money more than any of the other nations. Since the U.S. is printing money at about the same rate as the other nations, um, the U.S. dollar is not going to experience hyperinflation and it's not going to have an economic collapse. But the moral of the story is that we are going to have inflation worldwide and you can count on inflation and you can count on real estate going up in price because all countries of the world are printing money at about the same rate. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.